Thanks for watching Notorious Bassing. We're back on the Delta with some Lawrence active target footage using scout mode. Here you can see the active target. You can see the fish moving around. Those are stripers. Distance is currently set at 45 feet. Now I zoomed in and this is at 30 feet. And you can see the stripers moving around. At 30 feet, you can see much more uh, detail. The fish look a little bigger, as do the weeds and any rocks and those types of things. And I found 30 feet just about right for the, the delta, given the shallow um, water that we typically fish in. This water that we're fishing in right now, um, at the bottom of the boat, it's about 8 feet. And further out at about 30, it's about 15 feet, so it's relatively shallow. You can see a lot of fish swimming around the stripers and if you look closely you could see the shadow, the sonar shadow that we typically see when we're fishing in the shallower water like we are here. And here you could see more fish swimming around. Uh, if you look closely you can notice that the fish are all different sizes. We caught some of these stripers and most of them were relatively small. They were probably in about the 10 to 16 inch range. Here you can see fish swimming right under the boat. Without something like active target, sometimes you wouldn't even know that there's fish swimming that close to the boat. It's kind of amazing actually that they're just a few feet away from the trolling motor. And here's some more footage of the fish swimming around in front of the boat. This is the same spot and it's the same school of fish just swimming back and forth. Here, in just a moment, you'll be able to see some fish chasing after our bait on the right-hand side of the screen. You can't actually see our lure because we're fishing relatively small baits, but you can tell the fish are definitely swimming towards the boat. They're chasing after something, definitely our lures. Now, a pretty common question I get asked a lot is, is Active Target worth it? I know it's a lot of money, it's a big investment. And specifically for the Delta, I would say it's, it has some limited applications. It's more striper based, it tends to be more in deeper water. And by deeper, I mean probably about five feet or deeper where we typically find stripers. I haven't found it useful in punching applications or mat applications are beating the bank a lot of the things that we do for largemouth but for, for um, stripers where we tend to do more open water fishing um, definitely useful and um, I would say that we've definitely improved our catch rates by doing this I'd like to thank you for watching Notorious Bassing. Hopefully you enjoyed this active target footage. Please like this video and if you're not a subscriber, please subscribe.